Welcome to HTV News. Today is Tuesday, November 24th. I'm Wyatt Evans. And I'm Tristan King. Students, for CCRT, you should be logging into your Google Classroom account daily so that you are keeping up with your assignments. Also note that Ms. Torres uses the school's ga.google email account to communicate with you. Check your email. You probably have a message from Ms. Torres. To contact her for any questions, please email her at vtorres at ga.hobart.k12.in.us. More new scholarships are available in guidance. January, you will be able to complete the Local Scholarship Book online. It is a group of local scholarships only available to seniors at Hobart High School. There is an only one application, but you can apply for multiple scholarships at one time. Attention, freshman class. If you are interested in helping your class in coming up with fundraising ideas, you are invited to attend a meeting on Tuesday, December 1st, right after school in Ms. Smurden's room from 2.45 to 3.15. All freshmen are invited. After school tutoring in English and math is now available Mondays and Wednesdays. If you would like to sign up to get help, see Mrs. Hamilton or Mrs. Lounges in the Media Center for details. And now over to Nate and Chris for some additional announcements. The Toys for Tots program is starting up again. If you can help out, please bring a new gift to the main office to be donated to a needy child for Christmas. 2016 yearbooks are on sale now. Go to yearbookforever.com and select HHS to purchase your yearbook or go to room 1311 and see Ms. Pagone to pay with cash or check. Price is $50 before January 1st and $55 after January 1st. Get yours before the prices increases. Reminder that IUN dual credit forms for second semester personal finance are due into the guidance office by the end of the day on Wednesday, November 25th. Just a reminder, the pop tabs you have collected for Austin are due this Wednesday to Ms. Swafford. They must be in baggies and will be donated to the Ronald McDonald Foundation in honor of Austin Antle Smith. Now let's go back to Tristan and Wyatt with some more announcements. Do you like cold weather and being outdoors? Love to ice skate? Deep River Water Park is currently hiring for the Winter Skating on the Plaza program. Employees who remain in good standing will have the opportunity to continue employment during the water park summer season. Applicants must turn 16 by November 27th and should expect to work some e evenings, weekends, and holidays. You will be working both in and out of doors in changing weather conditions and will need to complete some training classes. This is your last chance. Check out www.deepriverwaterpark.com ice for more details. The season starts November 27th, 2015. News and World Report catalog, Find the Best Colleges for You, is now in the Media Center. Attention all seniors, if you have not received the required meningitis booster, please do so. Letters will be sent home soon notifying students that they will be excluded from school if they do not meet the Indiana State immunization requirements. This also applies to any other students that are lacking immunizations. There are over 250 students who have not completed their immunizations and about 150 of them are seniors. You can obtain these immunizations through your primary care physician, the health department, or the Bricky Clinic. If you have any questions or concerns, please call or stop by Mrs. O'Brien's office. Ladies, the girls diving team is looking for a few good women. You must have a physical on file in the athletic office and be a bit of a daredevil. Gymnastics background is a plus, but not necessary. If you're interested, stop by athletics to get the scoop. For lunch today, we will have stuffed crust pizza and chili cheese dog and potato wedges and with assorted canned fruit and assorted fresh fruit. And that wraps it up for today's announcements. I'm Tristan King. And I'm Wyatt Evans. Have, Have a great, great day, HHS. HHS.